Hello there and welcome back for another review from the Polish selection for Eurovision 2023. This time around we're going to listen to a song called Be Good by Dominik Dudek. And uh, yeah, without further ado, let's listen what this one sounds like. <laughs> wow, I'm gonna... I will keep listening to this. This put me in a good mood. Wow, I'm, I'm just... Having, I feel like I'm just having a big smile on my face. It makes me so happy listening to, to this song. I gotta say, like the energy is, is constantly throughout this song. I feel like it might get on a few people's nerves. That's completely understandable if it does, because it's all the time just full-on energy and full-on strumming, and the drums just keep going. It's very constant, rhythmically um, really kind of intense in that sense, I guess. But um, I think maybe melodically it's not too instant in, in its like overall hook. I don't think it's a hook that you will go around singing. Uh, maybe it is. I, I'm just kind of judging from my first experience because there was a lot to really take in. And the music video kind of hooked me as well, so I felt like a part of me kind of dropped the music a little bit because I was there was a lot to take in, a lot of uh, different things all the time. But musically, I think really engaging with how this, like the drumming is so so constant, and then this guitar strumming is, you know, it's almost over the top because it's it just never stops, you know. Um, I think these small sections when they actually break break up between, uh, like what do you call it, like the transitions between the chorus and verse when it's actually broken up. I think those are really crucial in this song because otherwise it would just feel like a never-ending loop of the same thing. I think that those are really needed to actually break it up a little bit. Usually I kind of complain when, when the energy gets killed in a song, but this one is so constantly energetic that it needs those sections to really just kind of take you back and actually allow you to, I guess, breathe and actually feel like this is a song which actually has a as a flow to it and and it's not just a constant push of going to in you know the highest gear and never stopping until the song is over uh, i feel like it's really crucial that the song is structured the way it is here um like the opening with these massive just vocals um kind of carrying the the main melody uh and then you kind of join in with the guitar after you go two lines with those uh, I think that's that's really fitting with how the song is actually built up, that you introduce it like that, and the way you end it with these vocal harmonies as well. Uh, I think it's really wide, it's really well put together in that sense. I, I think that it's really playful how you actually want the vocals to sound grand and absolutely massive and really overshadow everything else when they're being highlighted in this way. Uh, f because the rest of the song is basically just, here you got guitar, you got a little kick drum and a little drum beat, and just vocals that aren't really too, I'd say, remarkable. Like the vocal becomes a bit, what do you call it, like sheltered by, by all of the instrumental that comes around it. Um, I just love this this like chord interval that it does. It's such a simple chord interval, but it has such a charm when it's being played like this. Uh, basically going from the from the major one, major two, minor three, and down to the major two and major one chord again. It's It's like this little ladder of just absolute pleasant sound to it. And how that's also layered with the vocals doing the same thing. It's really charming, I'd say. Uh, and I get a lot of just enjoyment from that. Um, it's it's simple, but it's really effective. And especially in a song with so much kind of joy and, and energy as this one has. Um, this one put me in a good mood. I'm, I'm really just happy now after listening to it. And I think they absolutely nailed the purpose of the song. Because it's, it's supposed to be a song that's just charming inviting, makes you feel something um, of joy, I guess, while also being really upbeat and actually having the drive and feeling like a song that really pushes you forward. I mean, this is a song you could, you could you know, go on a run and listen to this song. It's perfect for that. It, but it also has the perfect uh, fit for just being when you're at home and you just want to be in a happy mood. It, it's like, what do you call it? <laughs> transparent in, in whatever situation you're in. You could listen to this song and, and just kind of have your mood boosted and, and get some energy from it, I'd say. Um, I found it really enjoyable. I'm going to be listening to this one more. I, I already know for a fact that I will. Uh, had a lot of fun listening to it. thought the video was really cute and, and funny as well. So, um, yeah, this is a great effort. I gotta say, I'm cheering a little bit for this one. But, of course, we have seven more songs to get through from this selection. So we'll see if anything comes up that beats this one for me. But this uh, this is a strong contender for me, I gotta say. I got really happy listening to it, and I would I think it would be very welcoming to have a song like this in Eurovision as well. Um, so yeah, those are my thoughts about Be Good by Dominic Dudek. Do tell me what you think of this song in the comments, and I'll be looking forward to reading all about that. Until next time, take care of yourselves, and bye for now.